Today I'm very excited to talk about AI art. You can see one of the AI part, uh, art pieces there, completely computer generated. And uh, the way we do it is to use Eon AI art creative uh, solution. What you need to do is to simply imagine a piece of art. It can be a sculpture, it can be a painting, digital art. And you say the prompt, the words. So in this case, uh, what you're looking at there was a Van Gogh sculpture uh, in the style of Van Gogh. Uh, and uh, the computer generated four different alternatives. One of them that I liked is there. But I will show you a number of these. Not only can I put them in frames, but we can also have different uh, shapes. Uh, for example, put them in the ceiling as domes uh, or concaves. And more important, we are not limited to just art images. We can do videos, animation, and even 3D. Let's get started. Van Gogh's self-portrait as a sculpture by Michelangelo. Alternative Van Gogh self-portrait as a sculpture by Michelangelo. Hokusai style breaking wave of Kanagawa with girl in a time machine. A man wearing a VR headset with a towering futuristic city behind him, painted by Noah Bradley. A galaxy filled with technologically advanced planets, painted by Alex Gray. Hyper-realistic digital art of a girl in a time machine. An old hermit creeping through the city streets of a populated cyberpunk alien civilization painted by Jason Chan. Hokusai, the breaking wave of Kanagawa girl in a time machine with complex gears and many buttons, blinking lights, rotating with Milky Way background. Monks wearing VR headsets in cyberspace, illuminated manuscript. A mad scientist creating a cyber world, 1960s psychedelic poster. The Kraken capturing a beautiful woman in a short dress, painted by Jan McKee. And now you can enjoy my rainforest exhibit all together, all the beautiful paintings, uh, spheres, etc. And most important, I'm using persistent tracking so I can lock in all this experience and I can revisit them and my friends can do so also anytime and they are there.